Hi, welcome back. Let's have a go at this one. 4 to the power of x plus I'm going to change this to 4 to the power of 2. So that's all to the power of x equals 272. Now when we have a number raised to a power and that's all raised to another power, this rule here allows us to either multiply those powers or swap the order of the powers. And that's what I'm going to do. So this becomes 4 to the power of x plus 4 to the power of x all raised to the power of 2. That's just swapping those around. Equals 272. Now, just so I don't have to keep on writing 4 to the x, I'm going to let u equal 4 to the x. So we now have u squared plus u minus 272 equals 0. Now let's see if we can factorise this. We need two numbers that multiply to 272, but have a difference of just one. And that means the numbers have got to be pretty close together. Now I know that 15 squared is 225. And I know that 16 squared is 256. I think that 17 squared is something like 289. Therefore, with 272 lying in the middle there, I think the numbers have probably got to be 16 and 17. So let's try that. We put a 16 there. We put a 17 there. A U there and a U there. Now let's get the signs right. It's got to be a positive 1. So let's have positive 17 and negative 16. And that gives us our negative 272, hopefully. So that's 170 and 102. So yeah, that's 272. So that's right. So that means that U must equal either negative 17 or U equals 16. Let's change this u back to 4 to the power of x now. So 4 to the x must equal minus 17 or 4 to the x must equal 16. Now 4 to what power gives you 16? Well 4 squared is 16 so here x must equal 2. And 4 to no power will give you a negative number. So this here is not applicable. So that's it. The answer is x equals 2. Did you get it?